It's good to be here. Uh, I love London. I love London, um, but I'm very scared of it. Uh, we got sharks in the Thames now, guys. We got sharks in the Thames, um, and, and sharks scare me because they're angry animals. You know, they are angry, uh, and I wonder why. But I suppose you would be too if, like, every morning you had to brush 15 layers of teeth. Uh, yeah, we've got to get on board with the shark material early, guys. There's two worst jokes about that, right? So, this next one's going to be probably the worst joke I've ever written. Right? So, yeah, talk about a rough morning and talk about getting up on the wrong side of the seabed. Yeah, there it is. That's a joke. Yeah, that's a joke. Like, you know, sometimes like, I don't know if I'll ever be a parent and then you drop a dad joke of such quality and you're like, yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> Like, I, genuinely, I really am scared of sharks, right? So I, I like, went on holiday with my family a couple of years ago, and I was scared to go in the water. Um, and my brother uh, was like trying to encourage me. He said, look, George, uh, you're actually statistically more likely to be killed by a vending machine than a shark. Um, and that didn't really help, because I didn't even know vending machines could swim. <laughs> So uh, I, I graduated last year, guys. Yeah, it's, it's well, my uni didn't even give me a graduation ceremony, so that is the best reaction I've had so far. Um, yeah, I had to enter the world of work, uh, and I, I don't like the world of work. <laughs> it sucks. <laughs> yeah, I, I ended up applying uh, for, a, for a, like all sorts, you know, and I, I always remember right, I got an email from a company I'd approached, uh, and they said, we've actually received over 500 applications for this role. All from you, please stop it. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I did get a job in the end, right? And it was for this sales company, and they had big dick energy, guys. <laughs> <laughs> their, their name was Limitless Solutions. Right? Uh, they were very proud of this name. They are very proud of Limitless Solutions. Uh, but the problem with Limitless Solutions uh, is they were registered as a limited company? <laughs> so I got all of the paperwork, all of the business cards, it was like, Limitless Solutions! Limited. <laughs> so then that's it was, we could do anything, within reason. <laughs> we earn millions in yen. <laughs> but uh, I had to leave because I wasn't ambitious enough, they said, right? Um, that hurt because I think I'm ambitious, right? Like, last year with the lockdowns, I, I was so ambitious. I was like, I'm going to get shredded, and I'm going to learn Italian. Uh, and by the end of the lockdown, I was, as the Italians would say, a big tubby boy. <laughs> what the fuck is that? <laughs> I'll be honest. Yeah, we must be along the guys off when I do the best joke of the city. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? It's quite relevant actually. It's slightly early, but my next joke is about fire. <laughs> <laughs> it feels insensitive now. They say you should fight fire with. <laughs> with fire. Is anyone on this? Like, there is an actual joke. Do you think we need to go out or not? There's no drill here, is there? There's no, there's no organisation. Not too wrong. Oh, oh, I think there is something wrong, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I have to change it too. Alright, I'm going to do it. Okay, so, they say you should fight for <laughs> Is this, this is not a good joke. 
Same. <laughs> Same. We fight fire with fire. Um, and, you know, I think sometimes that is true, right? Because a couple of weeks ago, uh, I spilled red wine, like red wine on my carpet, uh, and I got rid of it uh, by burning my house down. <laughs> Sorry, ladies. Uh, <laughs> and dad. Uh, <laughs> so uh, I wanted to end on the story of like the best uh, comeback I've ever heard to a homophobic insult, right? Um, so I was on a date with a guy uh, in Queensway, which is around like sort of Hyde Park area, um, and he was a, he was a great guy, very flamboyant, very comfortable in his own skin. Um, and we're walking along, and these two guys stand out in front of us, uh, and one of them goes. Why are there so many gays around here? Yeah, and I didn't really know what to say, right? I'm quite awkward in those kinds of situations. Um, but my date, like, without skipping a beat, goes, Well, because you're in fabulous Queensway. <laughs> now get out of this fabulous Queensway. 